Hi guys, I'm so excited. I have the November hip kits um, to show you. I have all the kits, but what I think I will do is um, show the December documented kit in a separate uh, video. So this month, instead of the pocket page um, style kit, um, the month of November, um, we have the December document kit, which is geared towards um, documenting the holiday season. And it's jam-packed full of stuff. Um, and there's also an uh, option to buy an album, but I will show this in a separate video. So if you're interested in that, watch the other video. And I'll start with the main kit for November. And it's so gorgeous. <laughs> no words. So let's start with the papers. Um, this is from Crate Paper, Snow and Coco, and this paper is called Joy. And this side has these fabulous trees that, if you know me, you probably know that they are talking to me and telling me to cut them out. Um, I just love it. It's so whimsical and the color scheme is my favorite. So this would be great for cutting up and using as embellishments. And the other side is this fun um, kind of cream on craft uh, polka dot that is really lovely. From Crate Paper, Snow and Coco, we have Cozy. And I love this side. And so you see there are like stripes and different colors. And what I'm thinking of doing is cut it, follow the lines. You see that there are like here, there's a line where the colors uh, switch and here and here and here and it's kind of random. So I'm thinking I might uh, go with the pattern of the paper and cut those out and use that as an element. Uh, so here, for example, it would be something like this and then you could put it on your background and, you know, add your photo here, some embellishments and it'll look really cool. So that's one way. Another way you could use this is to cut uh, a strip and use it like that. Um, you could also punch this. This is a really fun, versatile paper. I really like it. Uh, and the other side is a great tone-on-tone uh, -tone pattern. I'll show you a bit close up. It's kind of um, uh, like a teal and an aqua. If you ask me what the difference is, <laughs> to me, I think aqua is lighter and maybe a tiny bit uh, more blue, but don't, don't take my word for it. Check it. So uh, there are some exclusive papers in this kit and they are fabulous. So um, this um, this one is one of the exclusive. The collection is called Tease the, Tease the Season, not Tease. <laughs> Tease the Season, it is the season. And it, they were designed by Kim Watson. Um, and this paper is called Let It Snow. And this side has these lovely white snowflakes on a light gray background. And the other side is a cute uh, kind of random sketchy polka dot and I love the pops of black and white in any kit. So I'm really happy to have it here. From Crate Paper, Snow and Coco, this is called Hot Coco and this is the cut apart sheet which you can of course cut up. And there are some really fun images here. Um, you could cut out uh, this uh, bear, like fussy cut it, or this snowman. Um, just really lovely, lovely prints. I love it. And this is uh, kind of uh, banners. So you could cut out the little triangle here. And the other side is this nice uh, versatile uh, pattern, uh, another tone on tone. And I think I will be using this side because it's so fun. This is one of my favorites, uh, my favorite papers this month, but this side is pretty cool, uh, but the other side. So this is Crate Paper, Snow and Cocoa. It's called Brr or Brr or Brr, <laughs> depends on your accent. <laughs> I just ate, but I haven't drank enough coffee today. So this side, you can see it has all these black and white words, and I think it could be really fun to fussy cut them. Um, and use that as a title. So some of the words are like cut up in the middle, like this this one, the B is, is cut here, but you can use then the B from here and make a title, a really long B. 
Um, and the other side is, I love it, I love it, I love it. It's this gorgeous polka dot of like hot pink on a pale pink and it's kind of distressed. So, you know, like crate paper um, style. From Crate Paper Snow and Coco, this is called At Home. And yes, the birds are talking to me and the trees are whispering, cut us out, cut us out, chirp, chirp. Um, <laughs> I just love this paper. I think actually it would be great just as a strip of it. You wouldn't have to like do all the fussy cutting, but if you wanted, I mean, look at this cute house. And look at this cute birdie. That would be really fun. Or maybe punch them like in a circle. That would be cute too. And this side, this is, I am usually not a huge fan of um, any type of like gingham or that type of thing. And I'm usually not a big fan of multicolored prints uh, just because I somehow find them a bit harder to use. But I love, love, love this paper. I think they just made a fantastic job. So yeah, this is also probably one of my favorites this month. From Snow and Coco, we have Rosy Cheeks. And this side has this cute um, pattern. It's multicolored, but super cute. I'm saying but because as I said, somehow I always find them a bit harder to use. It has kind of these wonky little half circles. And the other side is this really fun, uh, sketchy chevron variation. Um, tone on tone, hot pink and uh, lighter pink. Really fun paper. It's one of those great ones for layering. This is one of the exclusives and probably uh, another one of my favorites. I saw Missy use this as a background and it's just gorgeous. So this is by Kim Watson. It's called City Sidewalks and these are exclusive to the kit. You can only get them in the kit. Um, so this side has this great uh, stripe and this side is this gorgeous uh, star sky. Another exclusive paper this one is called Merry and Bright and this side has this cute little uh, kind of sketchy dots and they are mm, red or pink on a very light pink I love this color it's beautiful and the other side is a lovely neutral um, kind of wooden floor type thing so I'll show you all the papers look at this gorgeousness I just love this kit and these are the B sides. So lots of, um, you know, kind of tone on tone and some neutral options. Really, really versatile. So in the main kit, we have, there's this update that uh, maybe you saw in the other unboxing, but there was supposed to be um, a, a package of My Mind's Eye Sugar Plum Enamel Shapes and they were defective, so My Mind's Eye um, is supposed to send the new enamel shapes directly to us as soon as they have it. So hopefully uh, My Mind's Eye will do right by us and take good care of us. The alphas this month are fabulous. Um, they are exclusive and they are foiled chipboard alpha stickers. And they are hot pink and gold. Love that. And there's a ton of letters. So these are chipboard. And then you know, there are also like some stars and a couple of these um, asterisks, what are they called? And yeah, these are manufactured by Pink Fresh Studio. And they are fabulous. Um, we have from Crate Paper Snow and Coco 10 die cut pieces. And these are kind of wooden shapes and some of them are foiled. Um, some is chipboard and then some, I think one is chipboard or two and then the rest is wood veneers. Uh, so these are fabulous for titles. We have these cutie patooties, I love these. Um, these are paper clips and they're kind of rubbery. Um, I will probably take them gently off the clip and use them as embellishments so they're pretty dimensional I'm just checking how I can take this apart so I think I could probably take a knife and very carefully remove like this 
section here that holds the clip. I think I could do that without, uh, hopefully without going to the emergency room. But yeah, it seems, it seems doable. So I'm gonna try that, oh, or maybe I can even... So if you're not, if you just want to use this, you don't want the clip, but I mean, you could use the clip separately, but you want to use this as an embellishment. I'm doing here some surgery embellishment <laughs> surgery <laughs> so I think it does come off like slightly so I think if I work at it a bit I can um, disconnect these and <laughs> really <laughs> really not being nice to this poor little tree but yeah I think it can come off or you could just kind of manipulate the <laughs> okay I'm spending way, way too much time look what I made <gasps> It's like the thing that your kids bring you and you're supposed to say, oh, that's so pretty, my darling. You're so talented. So these are the gorgeous, look how cute they are. I mean, seriously, it's like super cute. Look at these, super cute. And last but not least, we have an ephemera pack and uh, this is also exclusive to the kit. And look at these babies. I'm not gonna open it now. But look at the nice variety and I love those mushrooms and the trees and the little squirrel. It's so whimsical and cute. I am super excited about these. So these are also exclusive and designed by Kim Watson, I think. Yes, yes, they were. So that's the main, the main kit. If you need more paper and who doesn't need more paper, then you can get the pattern paper kit, which has all the pattern papers in the main kit. And the cardstock kit, which this month has two of the these uh, hot pink, really pretty. Um, there are two vellum sheets, which I love. I love using vellum. It's lovely for uh, layering. There are two white pieces and these are all uh, textured cardstock so one side has a little bit of texture and then the other side is smooth. We have this lovely bright teal, dark gray and a lighter um, kind of aqua. So lots of options. What I like to do if uh, there are colors that I don't uh, see myself using I either use them as a background if I am piecing a 12 by 12 um, page with like different pattern papers so uh, and then I know the cardstock is completely covered or I cut them with my silhouette and use it as masks or um, stencils so that's a great way to use cardstock in colors you don't like. Um, whoops! So the embellishment kit is very festive and pretty. We get these glitter foam stickers and these are called Doll. I'm not sure from which collection they are, but they are beautiful. They are silver, uh, foam and skinny and you get the um, uppercase and lowercase, which I love. I love having that flexibility. Uh, tons of letters, uh, a few numbers and then some... Uh, also, I love it when they put some sort of like little embellishment in the uh, package because I, I always use those. I feel it really brings a design together when you have that repetition of the same texture like the title uh, somewhere else on the layout. So I really like when they do that. What else? There's the rest I think are exclusives and they are fabulous. So we have these um, these are, I think, like washi, and yeah, so they're a little bit um, transparent, and they're super fun. Look how cute. So lots of patterns and colors. You get two of each, and yeah, they're just super fun. And then we have these stickers, And wait, these are made by Pretty Little Studio and they are super cute. So these are also kind of like vellum stickers. 
So you see, they they kind of pick up the color a bit that is behind them. And they're kind of forgiving most of the time. So you can correct your mistakes. And then we have these word stickers that I actually don't have to take it from the package because these are not on vellum or anything. And there's just a ton of cute phrases. Um, lots of stuff. I love these. These add such great detail. And um, the same kind of format, but different phrases on an aqua uh, background. Goes perfectly with the kids. Um, there's a little baggie of sequins, so I'll probably use that. Um, you can scatter those around or they're great for shaker cards or, um, you know, for using with your fuse tool or sewing it in a page protector. There is exclusive flare and it's super cute. I think the tree is my favorite. Look at that. Super cute. Love that tree. So for flare. And of course I had to leave this till the end. Puffy stickers. Yay! They are gorgeous. Kim Watson did an amazing job. My camera cut me off just as I was ooh and eyeing the puffy stickers. You're mean, camera. Anyway, they are gorgeous. Super, super cute. Um, you have some larger images and then lots of little um, dots and stars and snowflakes that you can just uh, spread around your uh, layouts. So really, really gorgeous. I just love it. Uh, and last but not least, the color kit. So this month we have this cute uh, stencil, which is kind of like, you know, you can make a candy cane um, type of pattern. So, but it's super versatile. I mean, it's just a stripe. And we get this uh, Dazzlers uh, from Shimmers. Uh, this one is silver. It's called Foiled Again and it coordinates beautifully with the kit. There we go. And there is also a mist that is called Well Blew Me Down. And I'll show you how these colors look because I have samples of these. So the Foiled Again is like a really nice uh, soft silver. It's very beautiful. And well, blew me down is this nice uh, teal that really coordinates perfectly with the kit. You can see it matches lovely um, the goodies in the kit. So yeah, um, these are the goodies I will be playing with this month and I will see you in the next video where I show you the December documented kit. Bye.